Hello Internet, it's Andrew here, welcome to another video. Today we're going to have a look at the mobile deals on offer for March in 2020 here in Australia and in particular today we're going to have a look at Woolworths, Optus, Telstra and for the first time we're going to have a look at what Aldi offers. Now before I start, can I please ask you to subscribe, that'll be wonderful. Apart from the release of the S20 range from Samsung, it's been a bit of a quiet month for mobile phones and we are all very, very busy with the coronavirus, so there hasn't really been any brilliant new deals released from any of the major players. But we'll have a look anyway because there is a couple that I want to share with you this time around. We'll start with Woolworths again because as I have mentioned before, they've got that excellent deal with the 10% off your grocery shopping and at Woolies. So that pretty much trumps every other offer at the moment and it's still the best offer by a long way if you are in a market for a new phone. So in the comment section of my last video, someone did point out that 36 months or three years is a very long time to be locked into a contract and I completely agree. Definitely uh, three years for a mobile phone, you need to make sure you look after it and there is no new phone feeling like Telstra offers or Optus offers. So um, it is a long time, but I still think value for money, you can't really go wrong. And I've mentioned also before that these phones these days, they are so good. Anything from the S8 onwards, wonderful phones. You're not gonna have any issues with them. So, you know, you're playing for a better camera, you're playing for a faster processor, but the S8 is a perfectly usable baseline phone. All right, with that in mind, let's have a quick look. We're gonna move past the top line of phones here because they are a little bit expensive in terms of a bargain. So the second row here though, I want to bring your attention to the S10e today. So there it is there. So for $51 a month, okay, so that's only $1 more than the minimum plan on Telstra. With Woolworths Mobile for $1 extra, you can get a brand new Samsung Galaxy S10e and that is over three um, three years. You can see here, 36 months. So it, yeah, again, long plan, but not only that, you also get the 10% off your groceries. So if you spend $300 once a month at the shops, if you do that one shop on the second weekend of the month, you get 10% off, so that's $30 off. So basically you can get this phone on a three year plan for $21 a month and that includes 20 gigs of data. So that's a pretty good deal right there. The Samsung Galaxy S10e is a very good phone. It is not quite the flagship of the S10, but it is right up there. So there's only a couple of little things that um, make it a slightly cheaper option than the proper S10. Okay, a new player in the market as well, and Woolworths are offering it, is the A71. So the A71 is Samsung's mid-range offering, and it's a brand new release. They used to have the A70, but they have now upgraded to the A71. It is also, check out the specs there. It is a very, very good phone. You're not gonna be disappointed in this phone. And it's only $47 a month, so it's even cheaper, okay? So you can virtually almost get this phone for free. If you, you know, if you're, maybe if you have a family and you do big shops, then the A71 is gonna be a really good option for you. So that's about it from Woolworths. There's a couple of other things I will, point out quickly, the Oppo Reno Z has some really good reviews. So there's one of them there, the Reno 2Z, it's 42 a month. I'll speak about these phones at another time, but for the moment, the A71 is probably the minimum spec I would recommend uh, for a new phone that's going to last you for three years. But these other phones here, once you start getting into the you know $30 per month range, you are they're, they're going to age they're going to age quickly and you're going to be left with a you know a phone that will not last the three years so to speak in terms of the developments that are going to be coming up next we move on to aldi mobile and aldi are a big player in the mobile plans area so they don't actually sell phones but a lot of lot of people discuss aldi mobile as a really good option. Well, they use the Telstra's 4G and 3G mobile networks, same as Woolworths. So, you know, you're going to get great coverage, you get to keep your number, blah, 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 all the usual things. But have a look at the plan prices. So, they start from $15 for three gigs of data and continuous data rollover. Okay, so that's amazing. That's a super cheap plan. Nothing's gonna come close to that. And if you are a very light user or you're a Wi-Fi user with the occasional 
off Wi-Fi um, access that you might need. Um, this is a great deal. But have a look at this. This is the one that everyone talks about. $25 a month, 18 gigs of data, continuous data rollover. That's a great deal right there. And again, continuous data rollover, all the usual things that you would expect from a plan. Um, that's a bargain. So if you have like an iPhone 8 or an iPhone 10 or something to that level, or a Samsung Galaxy S8 or an S9, then these plans can definitely, once you go off contract, these plans are awesome. Okay, and just remember too, there's no locking contract. So this is month to month. So at any time you have the option to change out. This is by far the best deal in terms of a SIM, um, SIM for your phone, okay, SIM only plan. Just moving on to Optus. So with Optus, I've just found that if you go straight to their deals and bundles page, they are really good at uh, sharing their great deals. Right, you do have double data and those sorts of things if you're a heavy user, but the real deal here at the moment that sort of maybe makes a little tiny bit of sense is the iPhone 7 for 32 gig version for $13.86 a month. Now that's on top of your plan. And so, yeah, and again, it has to be for three years. So that's where the iPhone 7 is going to break down in terms of not being a great option because three years, the iPhone 7 will then be a very outdated phone and we're seeing a lot of improvements in cameras at the moment and our iPhone 7 has a good camera especially daylight camera but as we go into any sort of low light situation that's where the iPhone this particular iPhone starts to um, lose out big time to the com competition so but if you're a heavy user and you use your phone for your photography or for video or things like that the iPhone 7 is probably a little bit outdated now okay let's move over to Telstra and look, all I can say about Telstra at the moment is they are not really interested in getting new customers from what I can see. So this is the deals and clearances page on Telstra and they, they say things like save $288, but then you're on a three year contract, $2,500, $50 minimum for your plan. So, okay, you might be saving a little bit on the handset, but you are definitely getting you know locked into a $50 a month minimum plan with them. So. I don't think that's a really good bargain at the moment. They also offer the iPhone 7, 32 gig version, same sort of deal, but have a look, $2,300 for three years. So that's a no for me. And again, I just wanted to say 4G more than ample for most people. 5G is very spotty, it's super fast, but it's way overboard for what most people will need it for. So don't get sucking in with the 5G plans. Just stick to your 4G deals and use Woolies, use Aldi. Stay away from straight Telstra because it just doesn't make any sense to pay $50 a month. So here are the Telstra plans. And you can see here 15 gig for $50 a month. That's a smallest plan and they're calling that a small. Uh, so if you compare that to Aldi or Optus or Woolworths, that is ludicrous okay so you, I don't see why anyone would pick these plans over those other ones okay everybody so a bit of a like I said a bit of a quiet month in terms of phones and mobile plans and mobile deals and clearances from the major players but uh, yeah look keep an eye out and if you notice any deals please let me know um, write in the comments below and I will put it into my next video but it's got to be a good deal okay? it's got to be an awesome deal for me to include it all right, that's it. Thanks, everyone. See ya.